Hey guys, yes, uh, I found a new way to make clan emblems, and they're kind of less of a hassle than Feaster's still, I guess, I don't know. I like Feaster took the longer route, but he's pretty cool, you go check Feaster7734. Uh, yeah, so, what you need to do first is download the link in the right, and all you have to do is click on it, and it'll bring it up. And it's not a gimmick, it's right here. You get this program called GIMP once you install it. And, hold on. There we go. Uh, once you have it, you go to File, Open. And uh, from here, you need to change your picture. Like, here we go. I want to choose. Uh, do, 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 do. I want to choose Picks for GIMP, this folder. And here I have tons of pictures. And on the right, they'll have the thumbnails. Fox logo. A little picture got from DeviantArt. Goku. You know me. Yeah, clown. Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's start with something easy. Yeah. Yeah, let's do Kirby. What the hell not. Let's open up Kirby. Yeah, you just Kirby. Alright. <laughs> what you need to do now is right click. Go down to view. I mean image, go to scale, and over here where it says pixels, change that to inches, change these to 8, 8.000, I make the resolution 0 0.72 first, should have told you that, and it goes really quick, alright, change these to 8. Yeah, sometimes I'll be stubborn like this, so I won't let you change it over real well. But just get close to 8 as you can. Hit scale. And it'll be like that. Little furball. Alright, what you need to do is right click it. Go to edit. And go to copy. And over here in file, go to new. Make a width of 8 and a height of 8 and make your unit inches and click OK. And once in here, you click, you go to edit, right click, go to edit, and go to paste. And there's your picture of Kirby. Yay for Kirby. Alright. You can see the grid going around him and stuff, but uh, the reason we made it 8 inches is because. That's how MGO is. You bring, you grab your ruler. If you don't know how to grab your ruler, you go to view and go to shit. What was it? Oh yeah, rulers. They had the bomb says show rulers. If you don't have rulers, click that, like that right there. Go back to show rulers. Pop up. All right, what you need to do? Is drag down your guides every two inches. And Feaster, do not get mad at me. I love your work. I subscribe to you. And you're just kick ass. So leave me alone. I guess he's gonna rape me. Anyway, after you get done with this. Make sure to go down by two, each one, uh, horizontal and vertical. I mean, vertical, horizontal. Anyway, go to filters, go to blur, go to pixelize. And here, your standard is 10. Change it to 18 as of right now. Uh, once you change one, you click in the other box, it'll likely change to 18. And your unit over here will be pixel. Click OK. It'll come like this. Yay, it's Kirby. Anyway, hey, you can see with this. Uh, in every box, is there an 8x8 pixel frame? That's why I made it 18 for. So you can actually count the pixels within here. This is a good spot to count these. Alright, right here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So it's the same as MGO 8x8, 4 squares. So it's 4x4 four four and an 8x8 eight eight with inside of them. So if you want to get a better view, you go to view 
and you go to uh, G, uh, go to show guides, and you click that off. And there's a better view, and if you want to see what it looks like within one inch on your screen when you're making the emblem, you go to view, zoom, and go to 25. Yeah, this is the same picture we just saw, and it's still pixelized. I think get a close up of this. Shit, I won't zoom in anyway. I'll pick it up. You can still see the pixels, and as you go back, look at one more detail. So, yeah. Oh, let's see, we got about four minutes left. Let's do another one. Anyway, all I like to do is go back to view, zoom, 100, and file. Oh, here's how you save it. You go to save as. And I save my pictures as their name. So it'll be Kirby PIX. Because he's a pixel now. And when you're saving, you need to type your uh, file type. So I'm type JPEG. So it'll be JPG. And you save to where your destination is. You save it. And this will pop up sometimes. It says it can't handle the transparency, so that's only because there's two layers and it wants to flatten it. So once you flatten the image, it will not change it, it'll just take out the bottom layer. So it'll say export and the quality. This doesn't really matter since it's pixelated, you can actually see it uh, on zero quality pretty well. But just leave it at 85, click save, and now it's saved. Uh, Next picture. And what you have to do, once it's saved, you have to uh, open it back up, uh, show your grids again. Not grid. Fuck it. Do not show a grid. It gives it aids. Go to guides. There we go. Grids are just fucked up things. Anyway, so your guides. And go to MGO. Uh, make your colors. And just type that in. Alright. Let's do another one. And don't worry about this one, so don't save it, because you can always change it back up. But if you want to save it, go ahead, but I know we don't want to. So, let's go to File, Open, let's go U.S. Army. Oh yeah, let's turn out nice. Same procedure. Go to Image, Scale, go to Inches. Eight, eight, and that happens. But let's go to scale, edit, copy, file, new. It'll auto save it from your last new file. So I have to do that. I'll just click OK and click right, edit, and paste. Where is it? There it is. All right. Expand it outward. And here you can see the image is a little too small. So, uh, I don't know what to do for that. Because I tried every single command. GIMP doesn't have a free select like Photoshop. So, I would just leave it like this for the mass detail. I mean, if you expand it outward, it won't look square and the star will be all funky looking. So, I'll just leave it like this. And nine minutes, so better hurry up do this. So, Image, I mean, shit, view, yes, show, show guides, shit, there's no guides, okay, make the guides, make the motherfucking guides, hurry, time's running out, it's gonna be a deadlock, 30 seconds, what well, I'm saying 30 seconds for. I gotta put my intro in here. Bye bye. Yep. I'll put a picture at the end.